the Holy Spirit is actually helping to form in you a garden for him. What I would suggest is that the garden that is inside of you comes alive through the metamorphosis of new birth. When you give your heart to Jesus, the garden comes alive. And then the Holy Spirit starts to blow on it. And he starts to transform that garden as he's bringing conviction into your life as he's directing you into a different way of life than you lived before you knew Jesus, as he's calling you to lay certain things down and to pick up other things up. But that garden is being planted and groomed and developed and cultivated so that what ends up being inside of you are beautiful things that have a sweet fragrance. Here's some of the things that we might consider to be that fragrance. How about humility? How about kindness? How about thanksgiving? How about yieldedness? How about trust? How about love and, and all the fruit of the Spirit? These are the blossoms that the Holy Spirit is growing and blossoming in your life. All these different blossoms, these qualities of the heart are attractive to the Lord. And there's a fragrance that follows them. 